Hello everyone and welcome back to Laidback Gaming. Yet again we're taking a look at Never Alone, finishing off our Let's Play here. Um, we should be getting pretty close to the end, not too much longer, so let's jump right on in and get it started where we left off. I hate how new game is at the top there. I've almost hit it so many times. Alright. So. We can. Go down this little path here. Oh, there's something up there. Shit. Are we supposed to climb up or down? I don't even know. I'm gonna take that as we're supposed to go up. <laughs> Alright. Um, what do I need to do here? Um, uh, I'm supposed to like just randomly throw it. Yeah, there's no possible way I'm going to ever get that in a million years. So... <laughs> Having nowhere to go... Oh, oh, we can't go here. Let's go this way, because I can actually break that. Without looking horribly dumb. Alright, so how we can beat this one? Um, why is it not coming towards me here? Single player options, controls. I should be. There we go. Now you come with me and you'll see a nation. Oh! <coughs> the tree moves. Would you look at that? Did it! I did it! The odds of that happening are like one in a billion, for those who don't know. I'm the worst at shooting with a bullet if you, you're just uh, watching on Twitch while this is being recorded live. Uh, instead of on YouTube, where the Let's Play is all, and everybody's seen my horrible skills already. There we go. Oh, we're moving. We're just a walking tree now. Alrighty. Thank you, uh, Mr. Tree Guy. But I don't want to go in the water. Yeah, no thanks. No water. Not what I'm looking forward to. Oh, 
Ooh, shit. Um, can I bring the one I'm on up at all? On the highest branch that I can get to. Need to lift this back up if I can. No. Oh my god. I don't even know how the hell I'm supposed to do this. Let's. Um. That one up. That one all the way down and up and over. So that I can go. Whoop. And then I go race this up as high in the air as I can. through here um I don't think I can Maybe higher, I think, so I can do that jump. There's this back up. Okay, now when the wind comes, I can jump. Boop. Bring it back. Oh, never mind. We're just gonna keep going. Yep, we're just gonna keep going. Nope. Oh, goddamn. I had a feeling I was going to do something stupid like that, and I did. Alright.
and over. This one I'm gonna have to bring down. Whoa, shit. God damn it. Um, excuse me, but yeah, there we go. And Bola, how many times am I gonna fail this section? Probably a lot, but that's quite all right. Seriously? Oh my god. Oh my good. Do all the barrel rolls. All the barrel rolls. Just failing for days. Like nothing here. Seriously, just one big shitty ass huge jump. Yeah, I knew that wasn't gonna work. What did? What the fuck did they expect? Oh, wait for that tree underneath. That probably be, that probably be smart. Didn't even see that. There we go. Come down here. A bit more. That should be good. Oh, that's a stick. That's on fire. And we got the evil mustache guy again. Let's break that one. I don't know. Face plant into the fire. Yeah. Be 
because that's just how I roll. Face plant into the fire. Oh my god. Bitch, please. I am going to, oh man. So far, so good. I feeling these are supposed to hit him or try. Or just break the ice. That works. <laughs> Using everything that they had learned, the girl and the fox has finally defeated the terrible one. For him, this was the end. Alright. So we defeated the evil, horrible dude. Uh, let's see here. Where do we go now? We can probably bring that up a little bit. Oh, we can bring it down. We have the Minion Slayer. Let's go watch this uh, cultural insight. Ooh, we missed one. Uh oh. I'll have to go back and get that. The recurring type of character in Anupiak stories is a manslayer. And the manslayer is kind of this bad guy. And I think really what's at risk when the manslayer comes into story is the livelihood of individuals and the whole community. And so the manslayer is really used as a way to say, don't act only for yourself. Always hold the community in your heart. Often time in these stories, there is one person that will stand up. And, and what this humble person will represent who faces that manslayer is a return to order a return to true living in the community and it just takes that one person oops I accidentally ended that there we'll watch this thing in here real quick the recurring type of character in Anupiak stories is the manslayer and the manslayer is kind of this 
bad guy. And I think really what's at risk when the manslayer comes into story is the livelihood of individuals and the whole community. And so the manslayer is really used as a way to say, don't act only for yourself. Always hold the community in your heart. Oftentimes in these stories, there is one person that will stand up. And, and what this humble person will represent who faces that manslayer is a return to order, a return to true living in the community. And it just takes that one person. It could just be that one person that can help to change everything. Because everyone wants to live a good life. Everyone wants to have a good community. All right, moving on. again. I can't even brace myself almost here. should have made that jump. I'm just gonna put that out there. I should have made that. I should be all okay here in front one. No. Thought I might have been safe being behind, but guess not. There's an ever so slight wind pushing to the left, but... Seriously? Alright. Jumping ahead with that wind now here. Might help out a bit. Get a little bit further. Oh, what the hell is that? Holy crap.
The girl found what looked like a giant man who used it in a daze to mash the snow loose. Then he shoveled it off the ground. Each time he did this, a gust of wind blew the loose snow, creating a blizzard that traveled in the direction of the girl's village. She had found the source of the blizzard. Alright, here we go. Get all the way up there? Uh, climb. We climb. Alright. Um, that should have hit. There we go. Um... Let's get this. Can we not wind? Not cool. Not when I'm trying to puzzle. 